Hey guys, we're back in um, waking up. I've been collecting a bunch of stone. Got a bunch of my stuff from here. I've left this, which is just full of all my pants, my enderpearl, my spruce, or my saplings. Um, let's just go ahead and take those. Take some of these pants with me. There we go. Cool. And we are... Oh, I need this as well. And we're about to take our run to try and get all our stuff safely over there. And then we'll be focusing on trying to get to that place we saw. I had one zombie wander up on me while I was hanging out. Actually, let's go ahead and... I keep forgetting that the inventory tweak style movement isn't there. And I keep trying to drag stuff out. It's really odd how quickly I got used to that. Uh, anything here? We'll grab this on the second trip. So this is a scary trip because I have a lot of good stuff on me. And I'm still hearing silverfish. I think they're underneath me. You know, now is not the time for that. Okay, so this is the scary part of the trip. It's this run right here. Okay, we safely made it. Cool. Excellent. So let's get this all home to our new place and see what we can do with it. Um, we'll probably... Oh, we don't really have any good source of wood yet. That is a hole. Let's cover that up. I didn't even notice that was a hole. Jesus. Come on, Vex. Don't fuck with me here. Ow! Okay, cool. So we're good there. And... There is something down there. So let's start by dropping off everything here. And I need that with me. And we'll put our crafting table here. And let's figure out what's down here. I'm glad I glanced down and saw this. Okay, what do we have? Chapter 2. Nice. Okay, we got chapter 2 and two golden apples. We have to go back and get chapter 1 at some point. Um, I hate this lava being so close to my face. It's scary. So we're going to dig our way out of here. There we go. And more blocks. Always nice. Cool. So chapter 2 we're going to safely put in there. We got some extra birch, or, well, we got birch, but we got some extra um, golden apples, which is phenomenal. And I'm going to take this cobble, and we're going to start working on a path this way to try to get to what I think is the first wool. I could be wrong, but I think it's the first wool. So, what we need to do is, this is actually fairly safe here from spiders my big concern here is these skeletons shooting me off what I really want to do is just basically get over here Whoop. screw you and seal that off and then get like through it so hurry through cool we're gonna put walkways on this or at least partially just so we don't get shot while we're working here and now we're going to break through here. Of course. Why didn't I assume this was going to happen? Okay, so... Okay, yeah. Yeah, it was safe to assume that that's terrible. Um, is there anything... That I can get... Let's break this. There we go. And... We're just going to slowly tunnel our way down through here. And I want to block this off as soon as I can. So there we go. Not fully blocked off, but close. That's going to be a silverfish. That is going to be a million silverfish. And we're blocked. I have to be careful because they're like battle cries here. Yep. I want the block that they're all standing on to break so I can block it off yeah cool and now it's just a matter of killing these silverfish somehow 
I hate silverfish. I really do. They're gross. Let them climb up a little higher so we can easily get to them. And eventually, they should stop calling for help. Like, if I can kill them quick enough? Is this theory correct? This theory is most likely not correct. A fair assumption that was a silverfish. I just don't want it exploding on me when I'm not ready for it. Lots of experience down here. I mean, if we can live, there's a ton of experience I'm gonna get. I really wish I had just the smallest amount of lava right now. I wish I understood exactly how silverfish calls work. I know that they, like, call for help and it breaks out silverfish around them. I just don't know, like, distances... Of course. Oh my god. This is soul crushing. The worst part is, I think they're gonna break down my... Yeah, they've pretty much destroyed my barrier here. I'm basically out of food. Okay, I got an idea. Let's go get some food and get some supplies. I have the greatest idea that has ever been had. It's probably one of the worst ideas that's ever been had. But we'll roll with it and pretend. Because pretending is great. We shall use the magical properties of sand to uh, our advantage here. I got some sand here. That sword's almost dead, so I'm not going to bother with it. Do I have another sword? Got some sandstone. That's not going to help. We got some gravel. Um, got some food. That's important. And a bit more food here. And a stick. Cool. I thought I put that somewhere. I was like real confused for a second there. So there's my sword. There's my food. I need more food, actually. I think I have mushrooms. Yeah, I do. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. Um, hmm. Okay, so we're good there. Let's leave the bowl and see what we can do. And... I'll be right back. And we are back. Sorry about that, guys. Okay, so I have eight bits of sand and two bits of gravel to work with. I'm hoping I can make something. How did these guys get up here? Oh, I bet they spawned up here. I need to put a torch up here at some point. Okay. I'm wondering if any of these guys left. They seem to have left. Oh my god, look at all my experience. Oh. I dislike the choices I've made today. But you know what? This isn't bad. There's, what, like, one skeleton and, like, 8,000 silverfish. And there's lava. The important thing is I don't piss off the silverfish. There's some more wood. Come on. Go. Okay, cool. He's dead. And I think if I'm quick about this. Skeleton. Kill these quick. Nope. If I'm quick about it, things get worse. It's all made of silverfish. No, 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 no. <laughs> okay. We almost made it. We almost made it. I think this one's just going to be a mad rush. And it's raining. Of course. Why not? The one place we can see the rain, might as well make it rain, right? We'll have to go back for that book later. I'm not going to deal with it right now. I really, really want to know what's this, what this iron thing is here, though. So we're going to find that out real quick. I feel like it's going to explode. Yeah? No. No explosion. Can I really get iron? 
supercharged creeper that has appeared. Um, not cool. Okay, cool. Got him in the lava. It took like all our health. Did I? Have... Oh, gloom. Not gloom. We're just real close to the bottom. I know I built a way back up. Uh, I just don't remember where it is. Hmm. Let's see. I hear something. That's a spider. Okay. Nothing in that chest. Uh, great. I built a way back up, but I blocked it off. Okay. I have a lot of cobble that's about to despawn in that room. I do not know why I didn't just go ahead and take care of that first, but such is the way of the world. From here, it's time to just... Oh, shit. Punch him. Punch, punch, punch. Punch Adelphia. Okay, get out. That's Creeper. We're just going to try to run past him. I think it might have worked. Oh, there was my way out. Just realized that I need to be on the other side of this whole contraption. It's a crazy contraption. Mousetrap. That's all I know of that song. I don't actually know the rest of it. Yep. One more hit and I'm dead. There it is. That shot in the heart. And that skeleton's to blame. He gives this map a bad name, guys. He really does. Okay. So, can I get that iron? I have a feeling that that iron's really just gonna fall into death. Why are there so many creepers? Like, seriously? There's a creeper spawner somewhere. And that appeared to be a floating corpse that I don't understand. Uh-huh. Going to assume... No? That is super confusing. I'm gonna slap this down if I think I'm gonna die. Like, that's basically the state we're at. As I... There's so many creepers, it's not even funny. Oh, God! I didn't slap it down. I didn't slap it down. I want that iron real bad. God, I want that iron. I won't use that for the victory monument. I'll be using that for tools. Getting that much iron this early would be huge. So where was I? I was somewhere around... Yeah, I was over there. Let's go across this middle part. Man, creepers just appearing out of nowhere. I don't want that skeleton anywhere near me. Sir. And that one has armor. Of course it does. Um, He just shot me out his ass. That's good. Okay. We are not in the greatest of places right now. Respawn. I think that iron block is gone. That's real sad. Ah. This is what happens with me in Vex maps. I get frustrated. And then I end up, like, just death running a thousand times. And then I have to sit down. Calm down a little bit. And then I'm okay to go. Um. So here's the thing. I'm fairly certain that iron's gone. So we're just going to leave it. What we're going to do is head back over. And perhaps some of those silverfish have been cleared out of the land of terribleness. I really dislike that they're spawning up here. No. Oh, that wasn't bad. That was barely any damage. That was important. Uh, they appear to have... No, they haven't. Run! Only three wool. Okay, so that's a lot of silverfish. I'm not sure how to deal with that. And I think that's where we're going to end this one. We got to figure out a way to deal with the silverfish apocalypse there. Um, You know what? I have a real easy way to deal with it. Actually, we're going to do one more run. We're going to die. And it'll be all right. We're going to exploit the mechanics of Minecraft. 
And the stupidity of silverfish. Their stupid silverfish faces. Okay. Here we go. What we need to do is get all these little fuckers to look at me. Hey, little fuckers. Okay, that's where the skeleton spawner is. I need these little fuckers out of here. Into the lava I go. And we'll just let them, the beautiful little things, attack my corpse. But I want to thank you all for watching. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and as always, have a great day.